All right, guys, this is what we're doing. It's only gonna take a couple seconds. I'm using this as an intro. <laughs> Good intro, right? Look at all these horses. This is only part of them. I get all those horses over there too. So we're taking horses to the back behind here. I made a little pin for now, just a temporary one. It's kind of small, <laughs> so it's gonna be lag central up in here. So uh, yeah, I just wanted to show you guys this first. I know my air conditioner is running in the background. Like I said, this only be a couple seconds. Look at this. This is crazy. Woo! All right, let's hop off this guy. I didn't mean to hop on him. All right. Uh, all right. The hardest part is getting your leads back. Oh. <laughs> all right, so I will catch you guys in a little bit. I'm actually not recording right now. I just wanted to do this as an intro for you guys to show you what I did so you know I'm doing it all legit. And I'm about to get killed by zombies, so I will be back in a minute. All right, guys, I'm done. I'm done. Check this out. Um, I am definitely the horse whisperer right here. Um, I don't know anybody else that has this many horses. Look at this. Bam! I'm sure you can get this many horses, but right now it's saying like around, uh, around 90. I know there's probably not 90 in there. It's probably counting other entities, but let's say around, around 40 horses. Well, let's see, count them. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, uh, yeah, blah, 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 yeah, around 40. All right, so uh, this is temporary. Uh, I just wanted to get, and I went I went on a lag stopping spree. Um, you're like, what are you, what is a, uh, hold on a second, guys. I think I'm on peaceful. I am on peaceful, dang it. Oh, and that reminds me. I created a map. I was messing around with some command blocks and stuff. Let me turn the sound down a little bit. And um, we're gonna call this map Ducky Hunt. Because it's duck hunt, guys. Come on. I mean, just for copyright purposes, I'm not going to say duck hunt, though. Um, but anyways, um, I'm looking for beta testers if you guys want to taste it, or test it. Taste it. If you want to taste it, it probably tastes good. Um, but it's pretty good. I mean, I've been playing it. It's kind of addicting, too. Um, and yeah, I'm looking for beta testers. It's only one level right now. But um, if you guys like it and download it, and it all goes, goes good with the downloads and likes. I will make it like the full-fledged game with multiple levels and stuff. It's kind of like a Duck Hunt versus game, like the arcade one. If you guys don't know, let me explain this to you guys real quick. There was a Duck Hunt for Home, and I'm going to stand here so deal with it. There was a Duck Hunt for Home, and then there was a Duck Hunt um, for the arcade. The arcade was a versus Duck Hunt, and in the arcade one, you could actually shoot the dog. And I think that's what people liked about the arcade one. Um, we got to put that grass box in there real quick, so we got to do that in a minute. But um, this is kind of like a versus. It's a, it's a PvP thing. You guys stand, look at the same thing, and whoever gets to 31st wins and you get a trophy. It's, I kind of set it up for like best out of three. So that's pretty cool. Um, I will do a video on that tonight. It'll actually probably go up before this video, so if you haven't seen it already, go ahead and check that out. Um, and if you want to be a beta tester on it, um, make sure you got a friend and you're going to send feedback. Don't just send me shit if you want to play the game, because, uh, well, I'm going to do like a little background check on you guys, too. Yeah, because I'm the police. No, not a background check, just like if you've any, tested any other games and stuff and stuff like that. Um, I might actually get a couple bigger YouTubers to test it, too, for me, and they can do vids. If you want to do vids on it, you can do vids on it, but let just know it's beta right now, and um, I just pretty much got everything going good for this one I mean god forbid dinner bone put like a crosshair or whatever um, what do you call it one of those bars for typing um, I can't think right now that shows where you're typing at in the books because you have to backspace the whole fucking page to get to the first letter if you wanted to fix anything so uh, the books I got to rewrite <laughs> I know that right now but ooh, pork chop. I don't have any raw pork chops bro um, yeah I went on a lag spree and you're like Woody what's a lag or a lag stopping spree well let me explain this that is a nice word for murder <laughs> I went and killed I went and killed all the pigs and chickens around because it's we got the farm so we don't really need the other stuff um, and let's get some paintings going real quick um, this kind of kind of gonna be a do all episode so uh, let's let's save the oak let's just let's just turn these all into sticks I know it's probably like, what? That's overkill, Woody. No, we're not going to turn them all on the sticks. That would be ridiculous. Yeah, we are. 
Um, I've been using sticks like crazy, and we gotta make fence too. A lot of fucking fence. Because I'm gonna fence out that whole area. But I'm gonna do that off camera. Oh, we got two more. Hold on. Oh, and I caught the zombie. I don't think I'm gonna put it in the beginning of the episode because he disappeared. Eduardo's gone. Waste of a name tag. So I don't know what the deal is with that. Um, but yeah, he's gone. I had him in here. And I. I was thinking anyways, we might want to put a villager in here because my secret door is right there. <laughs> so, um, but I didn't kill him. He just, I came back today on the game and he was gone. So, yeah, I've been seeing a couple other videos where they're like, what happened to him? Oh, maybe they got rid of him. So, I think they're disappearing because naturally in the coding, they're, they're supposed to despawn. So, we're going to make a couple paintings. We got, we got 10, um wool and I kind of wanted to make some paintings anyways so let's go ahead and do that this should make like eight and then nine now uh, this will probably be nine yeah all right that'll work actually you know what let's grab let's grab seven more one two three four five six seven and we'll get this place decorated up oh and I moved the portal too I dropped it down um, it's on the same axis, but I just dropped it down. I barely... What the hell just happened here? Oh, it's 8, not 10, dumbass. Um, but anyways. Yeah, I don't, I'm not sure what else happened since I've been gone. I'll think of some stuff. Um, I apologize for all the cuts last video, but I did not expect it to be... Even with the speed up and the stuff, I, I still had like an hour long video. So I had to cut some of it out. I tried to keep a lot. Let's check out this portal. Um, yeah, I just did this for right now. Um, I think this is, I, I actually like this little design. You can just jump up in here. Let's try not to go through. Let's try not to go through. Okay. And uh, it's pretty nice. I like it. And, it. and it prevents mobs from coming through. So if you got a mob, they're stopping right there. Um, I actually, damn, that's loud. I actually found um, one of the underwear zombies in there. Tried to bring him through, and he got stuck on these. He can't, They can't climb up over those stairs like that. Um, I don't know if it was just him, but I'm assuming it's all of them. But let's go check. Let's uh, actually put the rest of this stuff up real quick. I know, I know. Um, I've been doing a lot of stuff, guys. Oh, yeah, we'll get that done, too. Let me see. We're going to gonna take these for the chickens. Uh, we can put these up. Um... These go in the dispensers. So I was trying to get it all set up before I actually started recording, but I kind of forgot. Um, tree. I think we're good on the trees for now. I might decide to do something later with those. Um, and let's put these paintings up. We gotta put those back in the horse barn. Now let's put the. Hmm. Am I on easy or peaceful? I mean normal. Okay, I'm on normal. Let's go ahead and sleep real quick. And uh, all that lighting and stuff for that horse thing is going to change. I just wanted to get it out of the way. Hold on just a second. Guys. Where's my stuff at? There it is. Um, I just wanted to get it out of the way. So um, I could get them in there at least. So there's no horses. There shouldn't be any animals around either because some pigs might spawn in the swamp or sheep over there. But I'll show you in a second. I'm getting ahead of myself. Um, let's go ahead and put these in here. I got these guys breeding pretty good. We might kill them. Um, I might breed the sheep one more time. Uh, yeah, let's put those up there and let's... Alright, so to breed these guys... Let me turn this down real quick. Options. What's the sound? There we go. Let's actually turn the music down. Alright. So what happens is some of them get stuck on here just because I don't know. But what we do is we take this and the ones that don't get stuck on here, you know, these two will breed. They won't move for some reason. But these guys, look, man, easy breeding right here. You got to kind of hurry because the chickens like to drown, the baby ones. So it's all good though. All right, and that pushes all the eggs in here too, as you can see. Let's just let's do this so we're a little bit more organized. And I think we'll leave these eggs in here for now and just breed them. Uh, I mostly want eggs for like pumpkin pie and stuff, so um, 
I got oh I got all the water in here actually I think yeah okay I had extra that's right I had extra so we get some carrots we'll breed those guys and then we'll slaughter them um, I don't have a looting sword we need to probably enchant a sword at the end of the episode cuz and I lost my fortune pickaxe last time we were fighting those babies on the end of the episode we were trying to get that one guy a baby picked up my pickaxe one of my fortune pickaxe that I had on me and I guess babies don't drop your stuff once they pick it up so sad but true so we're gonna have to get I'm down to like one fortune pickaxe I know I was just bitching about having like three or four and I'm just like oh, losing them like crazy all right this is kind of they'll kind of push these guys down too but not as well I eat this real quick all right there we go get them kind of closer together all right turn that off and I should be able to I got some feather falling forward boots I want to fix guys so listen to those animals sounds so good let's kill them let's see how this works uh, you will pick up some stuff on this but and uh, I like to breed them and then kill them and leave the babies because you get like five or six babies other than leaving like two are you out or in I think you're out or you're dead all right, and then you just press this. You know, push all the meat in there. And like I said, you do pick up some meat. So, there we go. Let's do the same with the cows. I will put all this stuff back. So this is a good episode for murder, huh? <laughs> um, I could probably no, we won't do that. Like I say, I could probably set this up to breed and drop. So they automatically harvest and breed, but I don't think we're gonna do that. It's just, it's too a pain in the ass. Yeah. So if you guys do want a tutorial on how to build one of these, uh, I will do it. Just leave a comment below or something in my videos. All right, you guys bred? You guys bred? All right, and dead. Uh, and I did, I think I got this sword off camera. I'm not sure if I did or not, actually. Alright. We definitely need a looting sword for these um, animals, though. So I'd like to load up on leather. What is this doing in here? Alright, that'll work. Um... like that all right and then we just hit the button we can breed the sheep I'm trying to load up on sheep and get white wool um, before I cut any of them oh so you two can have sex down there or you guys can have group sex whatever and I think I need level 30 you definitely need to die all right all right and then we just Shut it off. Put our stuff up. And got a couple things on me that I don't want. Oh, I know what we need to do too. Um, we need to put this in here. There we go. And there we go. Just because I don't want to dig it out like I did the sheep one. The sheep one's actually looking pretty good. They're not eating it too fast. I know they will once they start getting loaded up, but. Alright. Just trying to get it uniform. I have OCD, you guys. Bad. I definitely don't want any chickens to fall down. Oh, wait. Right here. Because that would be annoying trying to find one chicken. Alright. And these chickens lay eggs like crazy, bro. I'm telling you. Like once you get this thing full, you get probably um, probably around 80 eggs every five minutes. But I definitely suggest throwing some. All right, and they're starting to die. You can hear them. All right, but we're good. Um, I do got. Yeah, I was just thinking if I missed one or not. 
I do got um, a lot of the, what do you call it? The koi pond done. So we'll go check that out. Um, mostly it was just trees um, because we were getting bombed by creepers and monsters. So I made like a tree forest area barrier and it, it looks really good. Um, got a lot of stuff, just decoration stuff really. Nothing personal. I mean not nothing personal, but nothing spectacular when it comes to like building anything. But uh, let's put some, we gotta put some pictures up man. It is dull as a motherfucker down here. Uh, I wanna... A one piece actually those would look pretty good over the bar wouldn't they let's do that put one right here one right here oh not the same one. Oh, come on put. this is not gonna go good it's not even damn it put it in the middle of the bar yeah I'll just put it right here um, uh, no. I wish, Dinnerbone, you need like a roll for the wheel so you can change the picture. That would be really nice. Where'd that go? Oh, there it is. Come on. Just sitting here for an hour trying to, whoops. Oh yeah, I forgot that's on this texture pack. But we're not going to use it because I'm thinking about starting to load my texture pack in here. But I don't know if, man, I don't want that one, dude. Come on, come on. This is ridiculously stupid. There you go, it's fine. It's probably like my favorite picture in here. Oh yeah, that'll work. Ah, oh, there we go. Sweet, okay, I like that one. Um, yeah, that'll be good. Let's actually put, should we put one down here? No. I was thinking about it. Uh, let's see, a couple up here. Maybe, maybe one right here. Whoa, that'd be a nice one. I think we're gonna use that one somewhere, but not right there. Um, okay. Right here would be nice. Um, where'd it go? Pick it up. Oh, there we go. I was gonna say I might have to relog. All right, didn't get any of them. Let's try it again. Nope. A little bit glitchy. Oh, that's my picture. Yeah, if you don't have that T-shirt, go get that T-shirt. It's on Spreadshirt. Um, links in the description. Upsell, upsell. All right, doesn't look like we're gonna get one. Let's just put one right here. There we go, that'll work. I might change that to blue. Where'd it go? I hate how you lose pictures too, all the damn time. Oh, there it is. All right, let me see. Maybe one right here. Yeah, there's that t-shirt. Uh, if you don't like, or if you don't have that t-shirt, or uh, obviously you don't have it because no one's bought it yet, I can check my stuff. But if you haven't seen this t-shirt and you like it, go check it out on my Spreadshirt. Um, like I said, the link is in the description. I think it's pretty tight. I got a couple more on there too, and I still got to work on some more. I got one with the experience bar. It says Chicks Dig Experience. So, ooh, awesome. Oh, yes, doubled up. I like that one. So, I'm going to make some painting for people too. Um, I think we're going to take that down. Maybe we'll put another one over there. Um, I think I want another one of these too. There's that fucking pit. You son of a bitch. Alright. <laughs> After I already got one up here. Alright, whatever. It's whatever. We'll get that done later. So let's go look at this koi farm real quick. Oh, never mind. I'm going to show you something else first real quick. Sorry. Um, I'm going to show you how I'm filling the koi pond. Actually, so let's put... Let's put these... No, let's put these in the books, I guess. Yeah, I did a whole bunch of books. Um, I'll go through these real quick for you. Efficiency 4. I did a few um, level 30s. These are mostly like level 10s, I think. So yeah, Feather Falling Forest, level 30. 
I got a couple unbreakings. I think I got three of them. Um, I got quite a few good books. We're gonna put them together and stuff and make a library of all good books. Okay, so let's go down here real quick. Let's put the water in there. Let's we'll leave it open for right now. Oh, let me grab a fishing pole real quick. I made an automatic fishing dispenser or fish farm. It is not my idea. It's not my design. Um, I will put the link in the description if you guys want to make it and see his video. Um, but yeah, it's it's totally works awesome. You can just go AFK for a long time. Um, where's it at? Let's just grab one of these. I'll grab both of them and put them in here. Where are all the monsters at? Maybe, I bet they aren't spawning because I got like 80 fucking horse. Oh, nope. There they go. Okay, never mind. I am very wrong. Alright, so here it is. Um, I made it a little tight because I kind of made it wrong the first time. Not wrong, but I mean, I made it the wrong way. I wanted it this way. And then I had it like this way, so I had to dig out this way more to recorrect it. So these are filled with the um, fishing rods. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry guys, um, and all you do is you stand here. And I got, I read a lot of comments. Like, it's not automatic. It is automatic. So this is all you do. If you watch Minecraft, Pyro has one on his channel. This is the exact same one from the exact same guy. So I will put his link in the description below. But I'll, if a uh, fishing rod doesn't hit a block, it doesn't take damage. All right, it only takes damage when it catches a fish. So pretty much all it's doing is it can't reach that hopper down there to hit it or anything. Now if I go like this, see it starts taking damage because I'm hitting that block. As long as you go like this, it'll be okay. So what happens is it'll catch a fish and it'll automatically like put the fish in the hopper down there where it's attached to a chest because it's not really attached to the hook. Okay. So it goes above the hopper trying to pull itself out and then it just drops into the hopper. It like sucks it in. And then it'll shoot out a fishing rod up here. And if my fishing rod is all the way broken, I'll catch it. But if it's not, it'll go through those half slabs, the white, the white half slabs into another hopper. It'll take it to the bottom of these hoppers and just keeps rotating. So, oh, there we go. I caught one. And see it shot the thing out. All right, so let's go down here real quick and I'll show you the whole downstairs part all right so this is all that happens it tries to pull the fish up but since the fish isn't really attached to the hook um, the hopper sucks it in and it puts it in here so let's take some of these fish and we'll see what this um, let's just take what do I got eight? Oh well let's put them all in there actually no you know what I don't want to put them all in there let's let's do 15 actually let's do less than that let's do I think I got eight so let's do eight and we'll check out the koi pond um, when we get the update I think I'm actually gonna try to keep this map but we might be messing in the far lands buddy just get new biomes so um, we're definitely gonna have a good world system going on if I keep this map but I really do want to keep this map because I don't know we've just progressed so far on it it's, it's really nice um, I wish I wouldn't have had to come out this far for horses. I guess that was my stupidity of looking for a village. Let me wait for these guys to just spawn real quick. Sorry guys, that was my lighter. My mic's right next to it. But um, I guess that was my stupidity of trying to look for a village. Um, which I did not find any village, I don't think, with a blacksmith shop. Ooh, we need to put a pressure plate on that door. So this is what I got done for the koi pond. And I think it's looking fucking amazing um, I've come out here a couple times and just set um, in the gazebo and just watched my screen on full screen and it's really relaxing I it just like a real koi pond it, it's really relaxing but I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna take out these not to not on camera um, I'm gonna take out these wood planks or wood logs and put um, half slabs in there wood half slabs um, probably cedar to match the house because that cedar too and you know this kind of this light bridge puts the contrast in it so I'm gonna keep that 
But um, definitely take that fucking half slab off the top of that. It's ridiculously annoying. And um, we're going to do the lights like this. So underneath these half slabs, it'll be right here. Or I don't even know if I can do that. It can't, I won't be able to do that, will I? Hmm. So what we might do is put the half slabs across here and then replace it. Not all of these with glowstone, but like every six or seven. So the water illuminates. And I think that'll look really nice at night. Um, but I got these lily pads. I got probably a stack of lily pads. Stack and a half. Um, put through them in here. Threw some up top. Um, threw some up top there too. Um, and these trees. I need to fill some of these trees in. I'm actually out of... Tr um, not saplings. I guess I got a lot of saplings. I need to go get some leaves so I can kind of like fix these areas right there and stuff. But threw some birch trees in every now and then. That... Those two are huge trees in themselves, so these two I grew on top of there because it was really low compared to the rest. It was like right there. You can see I grew one on top of there. So there's dirt up there I got to take out still. But I think it's looking really nice. And um, up here, let me go across here real quick. Try not to step on the pressure plates. Whoops. Ah, there we go. We're going to do a little path. We might do the path in these, but I'm not sure. Um what I'm going to do. I might take all this out and do grass just to make it look a little bit nicer. So no cobblestone except for right here. And then this all grass and then do these as like little stepping stone paths all the way up to here. And then right here maybe we'll do like a bench. And then over here like right here overlooking the water maybe we'll do a bench. Or maybe we'll do two benches like this. I don't really want to look at the house though, so maybe we'll do it this way right here. Let me just come up here and like, oh yeah, nice. Look how you guys are relaxed right now, aren't you? You're fucking relaxed. I know it. So this is blocked off totally, so no mobs can get in here. Um, I do have to figure out. I think I want to put the lighting, like where the torches are, up in the tree. Like let's say, right here, so you can't actually see it and stuff. Um, just to hide it a little bit more. So that's what we got done. And I really don't know. This is probably going to be an episode in a couple minutes, guys. Because I'm not... Oh, we got to do the fish. <laughs> that reminded me. Um, let's just do one for now. Each one. But I think that's... I think I got eight. I might have nine dispensers in here. I'm not sure. So... And the lily pads kind of give us a stepping stone too. So if we wanted to cross without the bridge, we can. I might only have... I could have swore I had one more on this side. Oh, that's right. Okay. So if we wanted to cross without the bridge, we could. Just in case we don't want to use the dispenser. Or I could walk up the side like I just did. Save us some fish. This is more of a decorative thing. And when, like I said, when the new fish come out... You got clownfish and pufferfish and, um, um, what do you call it? And the salmon plus the trout, or I, I'm assuming it's trout, or it might be like bass or something, the regular fish that we have now. So let's go in here, and I'm actually going to collect these too. So, so look at that. Look at that. Look at our fish. Look at our koi pond. It's freaking amazing. Look at them. Look at the fish swimming in it. I like that. That's freaking awesome. So if you guys want... Oh, no. I thought I missed one. Well, I guess you guys have watched me build it pretty much. So you guys can pretty much build it yourself. Um, The design, it's just how you feel, guys. It's all feng shui. It's all about the chi. Um, build a nice design like this. Um, and just make it the way you want to make it. Um, the dispenser stuff, It's you saw me build that. It's really easy. Um, if you didn't, you... you and you really need to know how just ask me and I'll I'll do a tutorial some if enough people want it but uh this is really relaxing let's go get these fish though they're expensive bro koi are expensive fish they're in scarce rarity and they're like almost extinct on the minecraft so I dig that look at him look at him. Come here, koi look at it. we'll call him Bill so um, I guess we could do that. I guess we could just like do a couple fish and collect them. Eh, I don't want to collect them every time. What if I forget too? So 
I want to have a good stack in each one just in case I do forget to collect them every now and then. But those are the last five minutes. And um, yeah, I can see I'm going to run over that a lot, not thinking. I want to get some more sugar cane in here, especially up on top. Um, yeah, especially up on top. We could do some bushes like over here and stuff. But um, I just want to do a recap video on this. Um, I hope you guys like it. I don't know. I really don't care if you like it because I'm the one playing the game, right? I don't come in your stuff and go, that's stupid, change it. Um, <laughs> but anyways, um, let's tame a couple of these horses real quick to see what we can get. And then I'm going to call it a video. We're at 30 minutes right now. Um, and i got to do a bunch of off-camera stuff like cave-in and stuff like that. So I thought I had sugar. Maybe I do. I just, I'm not looking at the right thing. So there's some sugar. Let's go get the sugar cane too real quick. Um, we still haven't made the, what do you call it? The catacombs. So we'll probably do that next video. And I'm going to fix the hub, another hub off camera. So I got to lay the rest of the cobblestone and try to get some. I'm going to go mega mining for netherrack in the next couple days. Because I want to get started on the gold farm too. Um, yeah, I want to get started on the gold farm. Oh, and um, off camera, next episode I know what we're going to do. We're going to fight the wither next episode. So we're going to get a beacon. I might do double withers. Um, I'm not sure. I have yet to fight a wither on... I have yet to fight a wither. So we'll see how it happens. I got this little technique on how to fight them. Um... So maybe you guys can use that to fight withers. Um, it's not cheating or nothing like that. Um, it's using basic game mechanics. It's not glitching. Um, so I think you guys will be all right with it. Um, you guys know I don't like to cheat. What was I gonna do? Oh, okay, I was gonna. We're gonna try to get a couple of horses. Let's do four horses. We'll just split these up evenly. All right. So grab a saddle. But yeah, all you do is you dig down. It's, like, you don't have to dig to bedrock, but it helps. So dig to bedrock, and then you dig like a long tunnel, maybe like 40, 50 blocks long. And then at the end of the tunnel, dig a little area to put the wither. And you stay in the tunnel and shoot him with your bow. And he, he has to blow up the tunnel to come get you, pretty much. And it, he's slower than you can shoot the bow, so it's not cheating. It's not glitching, so it's just... He's got to blow it up to come get you, bro. Set out here in the open where they're flying around. Ah. So we will get withered, so we'll take some milk with us. And check out this little thing. If you don't know how to do this, bam, right like that, buddy. Um, so let's get, I really dig black horses, but I want a gray horse too. So let's try these gray horses out. So let's feed him that. All right, and I forgot to grab, did I, yeah, I forgot to grab a saddle. Um, okay, so I'm going to forget which one he is. Hopefully he doesn't move too far. Forgot to grab a saddle. I need to eat something bad. Um, and for that fishing thing, if you're like, how's it automatic? you got to hold your button down. Um, if you change your, your place block button to like, I use enter on the numpad because I can easily set something on the edge of my keyboard and it's like right on the corner. If you change that to like enter instead of your trigger on your mouse, um, you can just set something on top of your keyboard like a weight or something. Oh, I got 10 sugar in here too, bro. Oh, that's what I did. I put sugar in there instead of fucking <laughs> grabbing a saddle. But yeah, just change your place button on your mouse to enter on the keyboard. That's what I like to use on the numpad right on the corner. And then just put a weight on it. So let me see, one of these guys, I think it was him, yeah it was him, alright so, see what he's got, Let's see what he's got, he's a good jumper, yeah he's pretty slow though, whoo he can jump though, alright so let's put him in here, oh and I went and got Spartacus, hey buddy what are you doing, alright, Oops, I always do that. Let's get a couple more. Ugh. I think we'll probably only do two on camera and I'll 
I'll try to cut it short for you guys so you guys ain't gotta watch me do all this stuff. Alright, let's find another gray one. There you go. Let's give him the sugar. Alright. Oh, dick? What, you want meth instead, bro? Okay, we got a jerk horse. He should be good. Good? Okay. Oh, yeah, look at that. And he's fast and got... Oh, yeah. This is the next naming horse. Look at this horse. I wonder if he can... What is that? One, two, three, four. I'm sure he can get on top of this. Oh, yeah. Easy. This is probably a five jumper, bro. Let's see if he can jump this. Oh, come on. Oh, yeah, four and a half. Oh, we got, the, we got the horse now. Yeah, get away from me, bro. This is the one. All right, so that's a good end to this video, I guess. That's a four and a half jumper. He may be five. I'll have to test him out later. I don't like leaving my saddles on my horses. We're gonna get we're gonna get bombed right here, guys. Where they at? Got me a bow. I think it's just a regular bow. Oh my gosh! Here they come! Get out of here! Jesus! I fought Mexicans before, and they don't even come out of the bushes like that. That was not a racist comment. I've really fought Mexicans and they come out of the bushes. I'll have to tell you guys the story later. But for this episode, I'm going to get in this house. I feel like there's a creeper behind me. You missed. I win. Don't miss, bro. Teabag. You can keep it. Keep it. It's trash anyways. All right, but yeah, I'll tell you that story uh, maybe next time, all right? <laughs> so it's not a racist comment. That's, it's an actual true story. Um, but it does go stereotypical with the whole popular stereotypes. And there was knives involved, too. Let's just say that. So, but I will catch you guys in the next episode. Woody out. Peace. All right, guys, so I almost forgot. I told you I was going to chance them with you. Um, pulled this iron out. And pull this gold out. Um, and let's fix these feather falling boots. So these are feather falling four, blast protection four. These are some beast boots. So we're gonna fix these level twenty eight. All right. Put them on. I got some pants, good pants too. So let me see. Decent pants. They're not like beast. So that's the ones I had on. But these are blast or blast protection two. So I kept those on. Um, and I will head to the spawner, get level thirty, and we will enchant another piece of armor. Since we are going to fight the wither next episode, guys. Alright, so hold on just a minute. Alright, guys, we are back and we should have enough in here. Let me check. Oh, yeah, 200 and some. So let's nail these guys. Alright, I got the sound off, sorry. Alright, um, and we are going to have to make some armor. So let's do that real quick. And I think we should probably go for a sword, too. We should have enough to make both. Ooh. I do have a. Alright. So. Um, we got. Let's make a helmet. Helmet. And then. A sword. And we should be good. Put these back. Oh, actually, we got nine. How did we get nine off that? Hmm. Awkward. I think I had, oh, maybe I was thinking of chest plate. All right. So, um, the lever out. Get ready, because we're going to have to pop these in there quick so we can use them. Ooh, that's laggy. All right, so, bam. Come to me, my little pretties. Come to me. Ah, yeah, run, run. All right. So, we'll do this first. We should have 60 levels here. 
if I'm counting right, maybe maybe short of 60 levels. Let's see. 7, 28, 29, 30. Ooh, fire protection four. Uh, that kind of sucks. But it'll work. There's thorns, so. Well, we need a blast protection, definitely, so. You guys did not die. Let's hit it again. Let's end these guys, see what we can get. They're all gonna die in the fucking grinder. Alright, give me just a second, guys, and I will be back to get level 30, and we'll get the sword going, alright? Alright, guys, so I am back, and... Ooh, an enchanted shovel. Not bad. Catch up protection 4. That's a pretty beast. They're leather. You always get good shit on leather, I hate that. Alright, so let's... This one's this one, right? Come on, looting. That was actually looks pretty good. I should probably grab that one. Let's grab this one. Fucking fire aspect of wood. That is terrible. That is terrible. Maybe we can. I wonder how much it would cost to put on this one. Jesus. Well, obviously, wait till it runs out, though. It costs a lot less. And it's only 24 right now, but we'll wait till it runs out and we'll. Ah. Dang it, man. That is a terrible enchantment. Fire aspect one. Really? Alright, guys. So that's going to be it for the end of this episode. And I will catch you in the next episode. I got a lot of work to do ahead of me. So Woody out. Peace. Alright, what is up, guys? Thanks for watching the video. And guess what? Remember that game I was talking about? I need beta testers. Alright, the video is up. I want you guys to download. It's top left. If you click on it, go ahead and download it. Um, you can download the play if you want, but please leave a comment telling me something about the game, like if I need to fix anything, um, what I need to add, what I should add, anything about it, if I should go on with more levels, if you guys really like it, leave some comments, okay? So that'll be top left, go check that video out, I'll actually play it and show you how to do it and what it is, and top right will be my previous survival video for the LP. Alright, so thanks a lot guys, um, and I will catch you in the next video. What do you out? Peace!